goes to set the ball screen. Vanover is shrinking back towards the rim. Darius Days will continue to get some terms of scoring. Don't allow 24 in purple if you're Arkansas to get to that free throw line 10 or 12 times in this game because he is more than capable. Two of the top six freshman scorers in the country in this game. Another three. The LSU will not throw straight man-to-man -man defense against Arkansas, but, but because they're not good enough at it, they will change their defenses up from the field or four from three-point range to get this thing underway. High arc. Keep an eye on that. Note with the ball fake, and he's flat with it. Tough shot. The American also March 11 through 14. Looking forward to that event in Nashville as we are back. And a nice little hit there from Debo. Not running a play. Arkansas, after a rough start in this game, right back in. It within one. Wild. And Darius Days on the bench. He's out with two fouls for LSU. Watford trying to get on track. To, uh, no. Yeah, he got right comes away with it. A really good action by LSU. They run a little go screen, smoke screen to free Watford up to drive that right side. Watford over four. Justin Smith trying to do some work and has a hard time holding it. Instead, he'll kick it to Davis who misses. Watford just dead. I think Austin is still trying to figure out who the call was on. No, Ted, that ball is blocked. Good recovery by Josh LeBlanc. And here comes Watford. Three ball. Money. Smart. That Florida State will have produced a first round guy that did not start a game. Cobb and Gelly a couple years ago. Point line. My top five as of starting today looks a little different than maybe other people. I'm basing it on how they're playing right now. Against Alabama and get to the free throw line. Just two of nine from deep. Darius Days, front of the iron. Watford, good hustle. He battled in for three. Tell you one thing, lost there. How about the good hustle by Andre Hyatt? A lot of times that turnover, he won't hustle back. They'll see a run out and a layup. And instead, he came back, deflected that ball away, and then a horrible shot leads to an LSU rebound. I, I don't know what that out of bounds underplay was, but a little three quarter court press. Just changing up the looks of what they're throwing at Arkansas. It's an Allen Fieldhouse. Interesting, if it's not Baylor or Gonzaga, who's the number one team or best team in the country, who is that team? They're going to talk about it at halftime. It's uh, I think it's Jimmy's top five as we see a most highly played game we've seen all year. Baylor four. I want to see what they look like today. And Florida State at five. I hammers, but man, he really explodes now into his shot. That looks like a good foul. hands. Yeah, no, good hands. Got ball. Good effort. That's a foul. And it's a charge on Trendon Watford. I believe it's Note that sprints his tail off and makes sure that he gets his shoulders in front of the ball. Yes, boom, establish yourself. That is a very good call and a really good play by Note to run, establish. You were pretty critical after that game. The note you sent me was four pages long. Mine was only three <laughs> lines long. Like, I mean, four. Down 80 to 5 Pacific. That is Saturday prime time. Walker's going to drive it. We'll step back for a good job. Arkansas to cover up that right hand. Days can. Days did hook. He got away with it, and he gets it to Watford, who soft touch falls. Can hear the bench, and he hooked. Yeah, he hooked the ball. Yeah, he is. Uh, Darius Days, Ravi, 0 for 5 now from that three point line. A 42 percent three point shoot. There's Note who came in and didn't make an impact offensively, but then a tough pass to handle and a turnover. LSU with numbers. Watford, that ball is deflected away from Jalen Williams. And getting sloppy here. Moody triple teamed. <laughs> At halftime, as well they should have. J.D. Note has been a spark off the bench with Tate out of the game. High Arthur, no good. And a chance for the Hogs to grab a lead. Something they've held for one minute this game. Wide open, Moody. Oh, to the rack, and he got fouled by Watford. He was winding up with a windmill. He's only yeah. taken eight shots. He's got the free throw line 11 times, man. That's well, that's winning basketball in a tough game. He made 10 of those 11 free. Lynn Williams. 
freshman to freshman the, the, the hands of Williams very impressive man for a big kid in his first year at the college level Watford he's hot at the last five you can dive hard and get get a good look Williams straight on three bottom how about Jalen Williams the last two ball games Yes, the kid Second came in shooting guy 20, too. Yeah, shooting 25% from three and just let that fly like he's a 50% shooter. Watford, he made the last five points for him, but he's short there, and LSU's got to be careful. Razorbacks feeling it here in the second half. J.D. Notes runner off the rim three times. Kentucky, yes, Kentucky, as of right now, and LSU would be number five. No Missouri, no Tennessee. Oh, he lost it and walked. No LSU, no. Your shot selection is the most important part of this game if you're going to try to make a comeback. From the ground, a little touch pass, and that worked out really well. Note was falling down and touch passed it for an easy two from Davis. You, you, I, I never question the effort that you're going to get out of Devo Davis. I love the story that Musselman told us, Ravi, when, when they do it, man, with a long reach. On the shot clock you've had as good a week as you could ask for a bit of revenge to work for them as that shot from moody comes up shy he battles for it now moody will shoot well no. before that shot clock wound down and he gonna get back on defense with a little word from muscleman yeah he, he and moses moody hunting that shot seven on the shot clock so coach must now has that offense in his grip Tightening that offense down, making sure they don't take any quick. How to finish atop the SEC standings with Alabama. I think there is. Alabama's going to get tested at Mississippi State later on today. Their maturity because... <laughs> you see yeah, the AP know. poll. This is why people are a little fired up. Baylor's two in the AP poll, but in the JD poll, they're four. Well, I... On one knee right there on that Razorback, Ravi, and, and ask her to be with me for the rest of my life. Right she on thought about it from, back, huh? Yeah, yeah. She thought about it from one knee kind of out to the next and finally said yes. That's where we met senior year in college. She was a cheerleader and we walked out of Bud Walton Arena that night together and struck up a conversation. And next thing you know, yeah. South Carolina is capable of doing it from time to time, but I, I trust Arkansas in this league as much as anybody right now, and I think you would agree with me. The way they're playing, absolutely. And where they're different than Alabama, who is so dependent on a three-point shot. You know, Arkansas obviously isn't. Today, Arkansas takes 19 threes. They make six. They take 32s. 42s. Check that. 42-point field goal. 19 threes. And such a good free-throw shooting team is Arkansas. 75% on the year. They're at 70 six percent today they take advantage of those times on the charity stripe they're hard to handle man eric's done a terrific job of resetting his team about five weeks ago on shot selection and this is how we're going to play and 100 percent buy-in and 100 percent confidence from that moment forward very similar to what bill self told me. now he'll be a factor for arkansas in nashville and ncaa tournament within the stretches of some games because he's seven three yeah, and a sophomore smart launches a three you look at the scoreboard Smith ends up with seven February and March is as important with your team as about any other thing and Arkansas has it to your point Yeah, and you know what else is a critical ingredient to having the joy in February?